my name is Astrid and I was doing the most beautiful energy medicine healing circle the other night and we did this really lovely balancing of your energy centers exercise and everybody in the class was saying could you please let us know how to do it so that we could practice it at home so this video really is about that it's just showing you the exercise that we did and it's just really really lovely so if you've been in um, a lot of stress or you just want to take some time to just really balance your energy and just come back into your heart quiet and down this is one of the most beautiful body balancing exercises that i do it's beautiful to do before you go to sleep at night you can do it lying in bed you can do it seated um, and you know you can do specific parts of it anytime during the day so just follow along with me and i'll just take you through the steps so just first of all um, i'm imagining that you're sitting down as you're doing this so just make sure that you're really comfortable, seated. You can take your shoes off if you want, feet flat to the floor. Your spine is long and straight, shoulders just back and down, nice and easy. And just start to focus into your breathing. So just breathing in through your nose. And breathe out through your mouth on a gentle sigh. Breathe in through your nose. And breathe out through your mouth on a gentle sigh. And the first part of this movement is just very, very simple. Place your right hand on your lower back and your left hand very gently behind your neck, just holding yourself in a gentle caress. So just close your eyes for a moment and just allow yourself to feel what you feel. Focusing on your breathing, allowing your breath to flow between both of your hands. So you're connecting down into your lower spine and up through the spine into the top of your neck. Breathing, feeling, being. And you can do this for as long as you like. Do it for as long as you feel right. You will know when to change because your energy will change. So I'm going to go a little bit quicker than we might do in a class, just to show you all of the movements. So this is really working to balance right into the lower back, the lower chakra, that lower energy center. So from here, we're going to take that right hand and place it on the lower belly. And then we're going to take the other hand and we're going to take it up and just place it on your forehead. Now just try this with me. So just close your eyes now and breathe. Just feeling the breath and imagining the energy between both your hands just connecting and aligning and rebalancing. Bringing your lower belly that wonderful wisdom and the wisdom of your conscious mind in alignment together in this beautiful energy medicine exercise. Taking time out for you to heal. Slow down, stop the noise of the world, come back to your wonderful body, your mind, your heart, and your soul. Beautiful. And then very gently, we're going to take the right hand and now we're just gonna place it up onto the opposite shoulder. The other hand comes down and you just press down, just gently touching the opposite hip. Breathe. Just feel this wonderful self-embrace, crossing the energy lines, holding yourself so gently, so tenderly. You know, most of us never stop to do this in our life. You know, we may hug and hold other people, 
but we seldom just stop and say, you know, I just need a hug. I just need to balance. I just need to stop, to breathe, to come back to me. So just allow yourself now to close your eyes and breathe. And you may, yeah, you may want to just rock very gently here. And then we're going to change over. So just swap both arms around, just holding your body and these energy points really gently. Close your eyes and feel what you feel. Be aware of your breathing and what you're feeling. And if your mind is chatting away to you or trying to get you to move on and do something productive, and just notice and observe your thoughts and come back to your feelings, come back to the body. Just taking this space and this time for you. So this is really working right the way around into this wonderful emotional center of the solar plexus. And just really balancing any emotional trauma that you may have had and you may be experiencing really wonderful to do if you've experienced any shocks or upsets. You just go into that lovely holding pose. So from here we're moving up into the heart and we're going to place once more right hand onto the heart and the other hand on top of the head. Breathe. Close your eyes and breathe. Connecting your heart to your crown chakra, to that connection to something so much greater than we are, an energy field, an energy vibration, whatever you want to call it, but that just that sense of there's something so much more, and just connect there, connecting that deep wisdom of your heart, the knowing of what is right for you. Breathe into it. Beautiful. We're moving on now and we're just moving into the throat. So right hand just gently holding the front of your throat, the other hand behind. And just breathing. This is all about your personal self-expression, your communication. What words are you saying to create the life that you want? Are you talking about what you want? Or are you talking all the time about what you don't want? What's wrong? What's not right? Are you criticizing, blaming, judging, having an opinion about somebody else that may be very harsh? This is the area that governs your personal truth and also creates those building blocks of your future. What we speak about, what we think about comes about. So breathe and allow yourself to really connect with what do you really want to say? When do you need to be quiet? So allow yourself to feel that lovely sense of energy into this area that it's okay to speak your truth. Beautiful. And then we're just going to come up to the forehead and just place both hands just on your temples, either side of your temples. And just again, close your eyes, breathe and connect. And we're really tapping into your intuition, that sense of knowing something, but how did you know it? You just feel it. You may see it, you may intuit it and it's balancing this energy here up into your intuition, your conscious mind, breathing deeply, trusting that, trusting what you know. And breathe. 
And it feels so good, you know, when we start to do this energy work. It just feels so good that you just want to keep doing it. And it brings you back, it brings it back in, to your body, your mind, your heart, your soul. Beautiful. And then the final movement is just gently placing your right hand just behind your head, just supporting your head, and the other hand just on top. And you breathe, as always, just breathe. And the breath is the bridge. It connects, it directs, it calms, it quiets. So close your eyes, breathe into your body, into your personal power, into your, your dreams. What is it that you so want to create in your life? Whether it's peace, harmony, joy, health. Allow yourself to feel that right now, in this moment. Go beyond the past, step into the future and act as if and feel as if it's happening now. This is the way we move. This is the way we move beyond our own self-limiting thoughts and behaviours when we take time to connect and come home. That's beautiful. And now very, very gently, just bring the hands down and then just breathe in, flow both hands up your body and flow both hands down. Lovely, flow up again and flow down and breathe. And the last little bit, let's just anchor all of this energy in and just take one hand, doesn't matter which one, and just tap into the space between your brows and just say out loud with me and really say out loud, don't, don't hold back, don't say, well, I'm, I'm too embarrassed to do it. Say out loud, remember this, remember this, remember this. And then just shake your hands off. Wonderful. Thank you so much for watching and, and doing that along with me. It's just a lovely energy medicine tip and it's a technique that if you're interested in calming and releasing any negative blocks and negative stress and moving beyond where perhaps you've been in your life into a new state of flow and freedom and joy and wellness, then for me, these techniques have helped me so much. I am quite a different person than I was, and there is just every day such a sense of joy and peace and harmony. And the other thing is that, you know, when situations do come up that really challenge you and really hurt you, when you know and you've got some tools to help you, this is when it's so valuable, because after feeling that initial hurt or upset, instead of carrying that on and keeping that going, we can actually say, okay, now I need to change my state of being. And then if you've got a tool or tools that you can do this, you can reach for that and you can come back into quiet. And the key of course, like everything in life, is that you have to do it. You can't just think about it. You have to take action. Because without action, nothing changes. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you did. And um, I'll be bringing you any more energy medicine tips and exercises and meditations as we go along. So have a beautiful day. Thank you so much for being here. And lots of love. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye.